This is the Horse Radio Network. This is episode 1182 of Horse Tip Daily, your almost everyday morsel of helpful hints, useful facts, and practical techniques for horse folks. Brought to you today by EquestrianCollections.com. Greetings, horse people. Coach Jen here, and thanks for tuning in to Horse Tip Daily. Today, Monty Roberts joins the Hit'em crew with some advice on catching your horse, or rather letting him catch you. And we'll get right to our tip after this important message from EquestrianCollections.com. Hey, everybody. Glenn here from the Horse Radio Network. I am with Debbie over at Equestrian Collections with the Equestrian Collections Product of the Week. What do we have this week, Debbie? Well, this week I want to talk about the Ovation Airform All-Purpose Click It Girth, although it also comes in... That's a big, long name. Yes. It also comes in dressage and other types as well. Okay. It's time to get in schooling. It's time to get back on the trail. And the thing about this girth that I find wonderful is that it has a spring load in the buckle so that it's so easy to adjust and so easy to adjust from the saddle, which oftentimes when you're on a trail ride, uh, it's, you're going to need to go ahead and adjust your girth halfway through. And this is so easy. All you do is reach down and the little a spring form a thing puts the little clicket thing in the hole and, and you don't have to get off and you don't have to worry about it. It's synthetic. It's hypoallergenic. All you have to do is hose it down. It's inexpensive. It's a schooling girth, but it comes in a lot of sizes that the other girths don't come in, um, all the way up to a 50 and a 60, wow. which you don't find. And I highly recommend it. My horse loves it. I had a hard time finding a comfortable girth for him for trail riding. I put this on it and it's made a huge difference. You've had a couple of reviews too on your website. Holly says this girth is awesome. Tightening or loosening it from horseback is so easy. The price is great too. Love it. This is around 40 bucks, people. Mm-hmm. 39.95. Yep, and that's the Ovation Airform All-Purpose Click It Girth, and that is from equestriancollections.com. Just hop onto Equestrian Collections and type in Ovation Airform Girth, and you'll find it. Hillary wrote, what equine body language cues do humans interpret incorrectly the most so when a horse a, good a horse says something to us what are how what are the most thing most common thing that we interpret incorrectly well that's a difficult question because we have different cultures we have different people and everybody does interpret the equus language differently um, uh, because of our own personalities and it doesn't really matter which one we interpret the most incorrectly we generally incorrectly transpose most of them. Mm -hmm. But um, oftentimes, the horse that wants to go away, and I I think maybe this is the most, the horse that wants to go away, we want to go get hold of him and keep him from going away. And the best thing you can do is send him away. Mm -hmm. Send him away a lot when he's tired of going away. Use that language of your eyes, your fingers, your shoulders to draw him back. Don't go catch your horse. Let your horse catch you. Mm-hmm. And when he comes to you in the field, then you have accomplished your goal. Now, I just did one for a professional polo player, very nice lady professional polo player. And uh, she paid a lot of money for a really high-level polo horse. And she couldn't take it to the matches because they couldn't catch it in the field. And it's out there with about 10 horses, and they catch all 10 of them, and she won't come near them, and they can't catch her in the field. And I said, no, let your horse catch you. Yeah, fine. Good thing to say. Mm -hmm. Let your horse catch you. You can't do it. And in two sessions here on this farm, now she comes to her at the gate before the other nine come over there. And it, it changed her that rapidly, and I've gotten four or five letters from her saying, it's working, it's working, it's working. And that's so gratifying, you know. So what did you do in that session? Was it a round pen session? Uh, is it a free l- lunging? What, what? We started out in the round pen, and we rewarded her greatly with lots of rubbing and loving when she came to me for join up in the round pen. And then we progressively went to larger places and did the same thing in a large 
place. And you do have to walk some mileage um, to get it done. But we were in a place about 100 feet by about 50 feet, rectangular, normal little turnout, you know. And um, when it happened there, then it happened in the biggest field we had as well. So uh, not a terribly difficult thing to do. Let your horse catch you. Well, that about does it. You can find links to today's guest as well as lots more tips at horsetipdaily.com. This podcast was made possible through the generous support of equestriancollections.com and listeners like you. Learn how you can help support Horse Radio Network programming and qualify for auditors-only perks by going to horsetipdaily.com and clicking on the Become an Auditor banner in the center of the page. Special thanks to our expert today, Monty Roberts. You can find lots more, including the Monty Roberts Online Equus University at montyroberts.com. This is Coach Jen, and I'll be back again soon with another tip. So until then, go ride your horse. The Horse Radio Network and the Horse Radio Network hosts are not responsible for statements of guests or their opinions. Use your own judgment when listening to the tips provided by the experts on Horse Tip Daily. (laughs) 